Hey y'all. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. This is Adana, also known as the Afro Seed. <clears throat> Say read for the collective. Hey collective. Hey collective. I'm just in a very happy, jovial mood. That's all. But that's every damn day. All right. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell to uh, book a private reading with me or shop in my store. All that information in the description box below. All right. <laughs> Let's get into it. I'm hearing, I'm so tired of repeating myself. I'm tired of repeating myself. Okay, let's see why. No, I'm sorry, I had to do that over. I'm sorry. <laughs> it is so right. It is so right. All right, let's see. Okay. So there's a decision that you need to make and you don't feel comfortable making that decision. Okay. I want to make this, want to make that very clear that if any time that you feel unsure about a decision, go with no. And the reason why you go with no is because you truly are unsure and it's best to be safe than sorry. You know what I mean? All right. Well, someone's very guilty. We have pathology here. Oh. This is a... What the hell? I don't even know if I want... All right. This is a questioning. Someone's going in for questioning. Damn. All right, Spirit Seed, talk about it. <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's be nosy. Okay, so someone is guilty. They're guilty of this crime. They are. There's pathology, pathology report, or just proof that this person committed this crime here. This person is very obsessed with this type of crime that they commit. And what I'll do is I'll pull my crime um, thing here so we can see what's going on here. My caution thing. Um, This person does not want to get caught, but they are caught. They, they are guilty of committing this crime here. Um, Because when I was pulling, I heard, um, I'm tired of repeating myself. So it's like, the person who is conducting the interview or the interrogation is getting very tired of having to repeat themselves because the person who is going down for this, I'm hearing murder, but going down for this here is not budging, is not saying anything or are not willing to say anything or they're playing this game, this cat and mouse game here, okay? It's frustrating the interviewer because the interviewer don't know how to interview. I'm just sorry. I just got, I can see. I listen. Hey, so I'm going to help you out here, interviewer. All right. This person plays a lot of mind game, the cat and mouse game. And basically this person is winning because you as the interviewer here, you're getting upset. Why are you getting upset? That's exactly what this person wants you to do is to get upset here. So it's like you're falling into this person's trap. You got to get into their mind. This person plays a lot of mental mind games. That's why I be telling y'all, stop playing these games. You learn the game and you keep it to yourself or whatever, child. But mm, anywho. Um, yeah, go into good, feel. We have good, we have feel. And it makes this person feel really good that, you know, this interviewer is very flustered here. So I just want to tap in and kind of see what is going on here.
Whoa, contamination of DNA evidence may be influencing this case. I just said, I, I did say pathology. Let me get one more. Okay, important details are not being revealed to the public at this time. Okay, I can't talk about this case the one all the way I want to. Cause I can see. <sighs> all right, spirit, just guide me, guide me. Tell me what I tell me what needs to be said because I can see, I can see clear as day, bro. Okay, just guide me, guide me, guide me, guide me. Guide me. Okay, so we have treacherous people, anxieties, possible risk and dangers ahead. You got to hit this person from the mind, from, from their, their, their mental state. That's the only way this person is going to respond. This is a short video. A spirit, spirit want me to come on here and just say that, but I, I mean, damn, I, I want to say more, but I can't. <laughs> this is short and sweet. Contamination of DNA evidence may be influenced in this case here. Yeah, well, you're going to receive, you're going to, the pathology here, you're going to receive the information. You want to receive new information that's going to blow the old information out the water here. Important details are not being revealed to the public at the time. That's what that is here. So I'm, I can't go, I can't go further than I want to, but I can't. So um, whoever that's for, because I feel like there's like an investigator that's watching me here. So. Uh, so we got Venus in the first house and Gemini. We have Venus in sixth house in Sag. We have seventh house in um, Mercury in Aries. We have Cancer, Pisces. Scorpio, two more. Aries, one more. Gemini. Okay. So if that resonates, please like, share, subscribe, and that notification bell. Yeah. Yeah. All right. <laughs>